CompTIA A plus Core 1, 220-1101, Practice Exam. Questions 21 through 25. This video is part of our Practice Exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 21. A new printer with duplex printing capabilities was installed, but double-sided printing is not currently taking place. What steps should the technician take next to enable automatic double-sided printing? The answer is D. Configure the duplex option in the printer's settings. Despite the printer having the capability to print on both sides of the paper, this function often requires activation within the printer's settings. Automatic duplex printing is not always enabled by default. The technician needs to access the printer settings through its control panel or software interface on a connected computer and select the option for automatic duplexing. This action will instruct the printer to automatically print on both sides of the paper, utilizing its built-in duplex capability. Question 22. In a small office environment with multiple wireless access points, there are intermittent reports of the wireless signal being lost or slowing down significantly. This problem has been noted to occur solely with the office's wireless network. What is the most probable explanation for this issue? The answer is D, device interference between the multiple access points. When several access points are in close proximity, they may operate on overlapping channels. This can cause signal interference, leading to connection drops and reduced speeds as devices compete for bandwidth. Properly configuring access points to use non-overlapping channels can mitigate this interference and improve the network's stability and performance. Question 23. Which cloud computing model allows for continued data access in the event of an internet service disruption locally? The answer is A, private. A private cloud model allows for continued data access during a local internet outage because it often operates on premises and on a private network that is independent of internet connectivity. Having this type of setup ensures that critical data and applications remain accessible to the organization, even when the internet is down. This is especially crucial for businesses that require high availability and cannot afford downtime due to external network failures. Question 24. When planning to upgrade a computer with an NVMe drive, what component must a user ensure their PC has to accommodate the new drive? The answer is C, PCIe M.2 connection. NVMe drives connect through a PCIe slot, specifically one that supports the M.2 form factor. This is because NVMe drives are designed for high-speed data transfer and leverage the bandwidth provided by the PCIe interface. M.2 is the physical standard that outlines the shape, size, and connector of the drive itself, allowing it to fit into a corresponding M.2 slot on the motherboard. Before attempting an upgrade, users must confirm their motherboard has a PCIe slot available that supports an M.2 connection to ensure compatibility. Question 25. A laptop is brought in for repair with an apparent screen issue. The owner claims it's broken, yet sometimes a dim image is visible when the screen is viewed under a strong light. What is the first action the repair technician should undertake? The answer is D. Check is the backlight is functional. If a dim image is visible on a laptop screen only under strong light, this suggests that the screen itself is displaying an image, but the backlight, which illuminates the display, is not functioning. The first action a repair technician should take is to check if the backlight is operational. 
A non-functional backlight would prevent the screen from appearing normally lit, even though the display is still working, hence the visibility of a faint image when an external light source is applied. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did. It's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.